Hello and welcome to City Skylines, Jackson Hole, Wyoming. I'm your humble host, Christopher Tarantola, and we are going to continue on with our expansion of the city and, and, and more specifically our suburban sprawl. We're going to sprawl the heck out of this thing. Um, as you can see, we've already started by adding a wall here, and we have some roads on both sides of that wall. And just to maximize our ability to connect things, we did put this road and have it bridge over and down, which I kind of like. Um, and so we're going to continue this on now. We're going to get really um, suburbanized here, just uh, kind of like the way we are over here in that sense. So, I don't know. Yeah, we do. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Okay. So, get my suburban streets over here. And, yeah, two lane suburban street. You get a nice curb of linears. And, um, I'm going to go ahead, since I have this paused, and delete this power line. Because it's kind of killing the mojo a little bit, right? I understand why it is the way it is, but we want to change that. Okay, now got my suburban streets here, and um, yeah, I think we'll come off of this road like this. Maybe we'll just go straight at first, and then we'll curve it up. Like this. And then have a dead right on into there. Perfect. Okay. Gorgeous. Alright. And then I think we'll follow that same tact. You could probably do something like that. I like that. Alright. And we're saving. There we go. So, and I don't want it to quite do that, so I'm going to take the angle snap off just for now. And then I'll turn it right back on. And I'm not going to go straight ahead. I don't think that's necessary. And we'll do it here. And that's that's perfect. I think we can add a, a nice little cross street right here. I think that works nicely. Yeah. Okay. I don't like that as much. Ooh. It jumped on me last second. I didn't like that. Here we go. That's better. Okay. Maybe since we got a hill here, we'll go that way with it. looks pretty good. Now, if I recall, this has like a negative area of effect. I wanted to redo it. Yeah, it has a negative area of effect. It's not too big though. Um, reaches out to about right there. But, uh, you know, maybe we can move this over here. And that'll allow this area to, to, to be developed in a way that it wouldn't have otherwise been. Or at least it would have been negatively affected. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
So what I'm doing here is I'm purposefully going off grid. You know, this was pretty much a, a grid. It's kind of an ugly grid, but it's a grid. This one's going to be more or less a grid, but here now it's it's it can't be a grid, right? So we're going to have to figure out what are we doing. I also want to probably put some at least one or a couple of these um, types of uh, buildings here as well. So, for me to be able to do that, you know, I got to have some larger spaces like this, right? Disaster Memorial, Friendly Neighborhood Park. I think it, this is a perfect time to be doing a Friendly Neighborhood Park, just like your Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man. Okay, hmm, well, I kind of like this area. For the park and that's where that'll go and I don't want to do as long as other city now no 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 what's this a Marriott hotel okay that looks way bigger than this <laughs> I'm not gonna place it because I bet you it's still gonna be tall okay what do we got here? Pyramid of Safety. Hmm. Can make something of that. Hmm. Opera House. That's a pretty small area of effect. Yeah, we could do this all day long, couldn't we? Definitely. I like that. Alright, got an opera house there. A grand library. Pretty cool looking building. There we go. What else? What else we got? BMW dealership, Rico. Why it's over here, I don't know. That's kind of an odd place for it, but hey. We can stick a, stick it right here. There you go. What do we got here? Some pretty cool stuff. Modern Art Museum. I don't mind if I say so myself. Putting that right here. Uh-oh. Getting some sort of messages. Okay. Nothing important. What's this? Theater of Wonders. Hmm. Can we go here? Without... Yeah. Wouldn't that be cool? Oh, I love that. Okay, it's a nice little space there. Okay. Sparkly Unicorn Rainbow Park. Okay. Definitely going to lay that out, but I'm going to do that later. Hey, guys, this looks so cool. Except for that parking. Well, that kind of looks ugly, but you know what? I'm still gonna I'm still gonna leave it. I still like it. I wish it was a little bit different, but I'll take that. And you know what I might do? So I might you know take these assets and change them up just a wee bit. Maybe too much. This one can come off this way a little bit. Maybe even have it do that number.
I don't know. What do you think? That looks a little bit. That looks good. That looks. That still looks a little bit funky, but it's not as funky. Right, and so now we'll give us a, a little bit of this. Be able to walk this way. Hmm, let's move that this way just a bit. That way, there we go. That looks great. There we go. Put some, another one over here. Now uh, we gotta take this angle snap off for sure. Definitely looks good there. Okay. go and we'll go ahead and make this connection here I don't know if I want to do that I'll just have them walk they can cross later so gotta put our cross rocks in here so there and there and what the heck there yeah. And we'll do one there. Go back and we'll do some more pathing. So I think that makes sense to come straight that way, but then we'll also do something here. that and we'll connect the corners here it's a little bridge I don't know that I want that why is it bridging I even have it like told to come down like this Whoa, that's really strange. What's going on? Something happened. Something funky happened. Come on, give me a break here.
like seriously? Ooh. Why is it doing this? Oh, what a ball buster. Okay. Maybe we can work with this. There you go. Not as pretty as I'd like it to be, but okay. We got it to work. Now, I'm gonna take it straight from here. And straight from here. But we also come straight from here, so. Let's do that, and then we'll do this one that just goes to it, All right? No, not quite. Let's do it to there and then to here. That works. Okay. And um, we'll do that. Still not important. Okay, and uh, I'm gonna do something with this area here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I'm gonna leave it alone for now. That's what I'm gonna do. Um, yeah, I think that's looking great. Yeah, yeah. Now what would be cool is if we were able to kind of connect that up so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and do that number there and uh, kind of go straight over right and I want to make sure that we have our crosswalks there and there. I don't know that we need a light for the crosswalk. There we go. But we might as well have this come over here. Like that. Oh yeah. Okay. What else, guys? I think that's pretty much done. So we'll do this side now. And then we'll zone it up and we'll be we'll be there. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to this number here and I wonder if I want to make that more of a regular grid I can Ooh, excuse me because you know, this really needs to continue all the way out to here that road needs to just go straight and it's going to be the old version here. Angle snap. There we go. Doesn't have an 
nice pretty when like the medium and large roads do. Oh well. Right, and that'll that'll fit into the grid later on. Yeah, we definitely got some work to do moving that later. That'll be probably my very next thing. Okay, so now that we got that done, we can go back and do this. Hmm, excuse me. Now this one, we're going to need to make sure we do our on and off ramps. So let's go ahead and do that. Do I want to do it back here, or do I want to do it up here? I guess I'd want to do it back here. That's where I would do it. Let's do this way. something like that and something like that and we'll use our move it mod here to up oh, a little bit too far I think I want that to be straight for sure and that one could be straight there we go There we go. And then this can also be straight. That work? Yeah, that works. On, but we won't really want this to be this way. There you go. And we'll do the same thing on this side. Okay, let's spin this the right way. Maybe make that straight. Yeah, that looks good to me. Bin that the right way. Well, I didn't want that. Okay, that works. Okay. Looks great. Now, we just want to make sure you take off the lights. I guess we only have the light right there. And, um, I want to have a train station here, I think, as well. So, I wonder if we want to have the train station, like, be right here because we wanted to be able to access this um, airport here we also want it to be for these folks um, if it's gonna be you know um, halfway between this one and this one um, so these guys can kind of go to both um, so where shall we put it I think this space is definitely ripe to have that 
Um, we could almost do it right here, but uh, we don't want to get too close to the airport just for um, realistic looking sakes. So we might come off here and um, have our have it right here. I don't know. So it really wants to be going this way, right? So maybe we do it more like over here, going this way. We have a node there to there. And we also got to think about how we're going to revamp this whole section here. Now, the only, about the only thing that's going to stay is the road will still be the road, but it, it's probably not going to be one way, or this one is probably going to be one way going that way, so that it and then it'll be able to circle around. You know, something along those lines. Yeah, we gotta think about this. Hmm. I think I'm gonna put a medium, medium sized road. Yeah, that connects this up. We'll at least have grass meeting here. And we'll just have it go straight. That's close enough. Yeah, we'll do it like that. And then we'll have the train station. So let's pick our train station. We've got a couple cool ones. Advanced rail station. Um, elevated station with metro. I don't think we're ready for that. Elevated train station. Which I think I've already used. You got this one, which is pretty cool looking. I think I'm gonna use that one. I like that. So we'll go right there. And then we'll go and get our rail. Now this has two and they're one way. So I'll need to, to think about how that works as well. So how do I want to route it? Do I just kind of do a lazy thing? I don't think so. I think this needs to come like go above the road even and come there. And I do have a couple above the road rails, don't I? Yeah. So, I don't know how this is supposed to work, but, well, I guess we'll just click right there. This is my first time using this new, these new assets. Looks fantastic. I think we'll do it to, like, right there. And then we'll just uh, have this come off like that. We definitely want this to be up in the air. And yeah, like why why is it going down to go back up? I don't know. So there we go. And click it like that. That looks fantastic. And we'll oop, take it from here. Again, we want to be up at least at nine. And then we'll go the one way from there to there. And from there to there, which looks horrible, so we will try and fix that. That should just be straight like that and then this can just probably be straight itself. Yeah, that looks good. Now how come that didn't that didn't take? What's going on with that? 
why isn't it that taken? Oh, well that's frustrating. It took on the back side, but it's not taken on this side. It's taken right there. And it's kind of taken right there. Let's see, watch. As soon as I do that, it's fine. Hmm. But it's not taking right there. Why can't I? Oh, I know what. Let's see here. Did it work? It's still not working. Hmm. Is there another rail asset that I need to be using? Vanilla style single station track extension. Hmm. Let's try this. What is this? Height is too high. Height is too high. Height is too high, so that ain't it. Man, that's a shame because it's such a great station, but if I can't get my trains in, then you not going to work too well. Oh well, that's that. That is a real shame because uh, it was a good looking station. I'll try it one more time. Let's try it one more time. Might as well. What? What's the worst that can happen? Right? Worst that can happen. It just doesn't work. Okay, and then we do our one way rail. Oh. Yeah. Just no. Okay. Yeah, something was wrong there. See how it left that whole asset there? That that's just not that's just not right. Okay, um so let's pick another rail station. Get the Irwindale station. It seems exceedingly simple. I wonder if that, oh, here we go, just connect it here, let's do it straight for at least a little bit, yeah, that seems to work just fine, so I'll just delete this up to there, and we'll page things up a bit. Let's do a straight slope. How's it? Would that work? That'll work. There we go. That works. Okay. And then this will connect back up. I wonder if we go this way or if we bring it back in and somehow do a dosio -do. I know what I'll do. Okay. So, we'll go ahead and take this and what we're going to do is Man, this is a it's a it's a tight turn. It's about as shallow as I can get it though. 
let's take the snap off so it'll go right next to that road and it'll go right next to the road here we'll put the snap back on like that and then we'll want to straighten that up There we go. We can even lower that down just a bit. We can make it attached to the ground like that so it doesn't look so awkward. Maybe bring that one down a little bit. We can bring that one back up a little bit. Just a little bit, not too much. Okay. I'll take that. So it comes out this way. It connects. And goes back in. And it really bypasses this whole thing altogether. Right. I think that works. Now, I don't want that to be a, an intercity station. So you need to take that off. And it's just a really super simple station. I like that. Nothing fancy. Um, at all. And if anything, we might need to have like some sort of pedestrian bridge to get on this side over here. I don't know. Definitely going to put like a crosswalk here. Let's take these lights off. God awful lights. Oh, lights everywhere. I'll have to do a once over. But, um, it will take the lights off and then we'll have a pathway here. Uh, there it is. Here's my pathway. Yeah. So, we'll start it off here and we're just going to bring it straight. Well, let's, let's do some curvy stuff. So, We'll bring it around this way, like that. And I think I'm going to bring this and make this nice and big going around. I like that. Well, as long as I can keep it attached to the ground. The idea is that it's just a bigger sidewalk since it's overlooking this this uh, cliff here, or the, the wall. I don't know if that looks fantastic or not, but yeah, we'll take it. Okay, and so we'll put this going around. You know, and I know this is a lot of prep, guys, but in the end I think it's going to really pay off. I'm going to leave it at that for now. Okay. So there's that. Gives people another way to go. I probably want to put like a nice little parking here. So I know we have some at the back here. I wonder if that road should really be like one of these roads. then we'll need to find our parking asset hmm parking random street prop okay parking marker 
basic road with painted median. Okay, single, accessible. Then are these all those parking spaces? We got these parking spaces. Do we have any diagonals though? It's electric only. We got a little parking garage. Bunch of roads with parking on the side. Oh, that's frustrating. I don't have any diagonal parking. I, I don't even understand how that's possible. <laughs> okay. Well, um, I'll actually, I'm going to just leave it for now, and I'll come back when I have the diagonal parking. Okay. So, there's that. Why are oh, I know. Okay, we're in the final mile. Oh, okay, now I can move around. I was like, whoa, hey. Um, so I know it doesn't look like we did a lot, but we really did. When you think of how detailed we got, there's some pretty good detail in there with our little pathways there. Um, we got our rail set up and everything, and we're gonna have to put a cut in it there. But uh, thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next, next episode.